Hey guys, so today I want to talk to you about apps or websites that you can use to save money for your family and your household. Um, a lot of times when you go to the store, you take in like the little paper coupons that you've clipped out of the newspaper. Um, but a lot of stores, like we have uh, Kroger, and I know they have different ones by different names, and I can't remember the names off the top of my head, um, but in different like states and stuff like that, they have different ones, but they're all affiliated the same thing. So like our store is Kroger, and what you can do is you can go onto their app and load coupons to the app. And then that will also um, link up to the little, you know, key card that you have that you just scan at the store, kind of like with Walgreens and CVS and Food Lion and stuff like that. Um, and that is a really great, helpful um, app to use. They also, I believe you can do it on the website. <clears throat> but you can also um, check out their sales ads. They have tons of... Um, well, they have their ads and their um, weekly ads listed on the app that you can scroll through. You can actually like um, circle them and um, circle the items that you like and they can add it to your grocery list, um, which is really helpful. And then there's a couple other ones that I use that I'm going to show you on my phone. I use Ibotta, which I'll explain. And then I use the Walmart Savings Catcher app. Um, if you just download the Walmart app, I'm going to show you how to use that. Um, you can scan your receipt and it searches other stores in your area and matches the items that you purchased. And they will give you back the money if it's the items on sale somewhere else. But I'll show you how that works. So let's take a look at my phone. Okay, so this is the Walmart app. You can download it in this, your app store. And so right here, it says Savings Catcher. You'll click that, and you have to do this within seven days of purchasing items. I blacked out some personal information. Um, but, so I have two receipts. One was from the 12th and one was from the 13th. So it's already, because I already have ones in here, and I accidentally deleted this. But so far, I have $14.18. So sometimes you'll go and scan your receipt, and it actually doesn't give you any money back because they have the best prices. Um, sometimes you can get like a dollar, 20 cents, 15 cents. Sometimes it might not be anything, but it does add up. My mother actually bought, um, she had $68 in her savings catcher and they sent her, I think it was a Walmart gift card. And I'm still scanning all my receipts that I have. Um, and she bought a steam mop. So I'm going to hit scan receipt and what do you do is just hold it right there hopefully it will work sometimes it does it and you have to scan it and we'll clean my camera uh, let me try this one there okay so it got that one so then this little page will come up and you have to choose the date and that one was the 12th and then you hit submit now it can take up to about 24 hours I believe I think it tells you um, oh they'll notify you within three days of it so I'm going to show you let's see if it shows my receipts this is the receipt it will actually show you the receipt hold on baby um, that you have so yeah this is what I bought it actually shows you the items on the side uh, let's see here here's my receipts right here and I will show you stuff that I've gotten money back on. See, like it says, no lower prices found. Um, this one, I got $1.73 back. So what did they do, once it opens up. All right, so I'll get um, $1.73 back on this one. And it was on... Pepsi Cola. So the Walmart price was $4.48 and Kroger had it for $2.75. So they are giving me $1.73 for the difference. And they'll do that to all the items. So like once it goes through, but you'll see in forever. Um, here's one for 19 cents. <clears throat> yep, it's your time. My battery's just blinking. And that one was for a ginger ale. Kroger is always where the cheaper prices are. <laughs> but, um, so that you get the gist. Um, and I just keep adding it up. So, hold on. So that I can cash it in one time. So I also use the Ibotta. And I'm going to show you how to use that one. And then I have my Kroger one. And I think that's it yeah so i use i bought a kroger and the walmart app right here 
So if you use any apps on your phones that saves you money, let me know. Um, the Ibotta, well I've already showed you, I'll show you a clip of that explaining how that works. Alright, so here is the Ibotta app and it is free so you just download it and you type in, I think it's your like zip code when you first get it, but I shopped at Kroger and I did Sam's. You can actually um, search the store, so I'm doing Kroger right now. And what you do is you just... <laughs> Okay, so this is my Kroger one, so I'm just going through, I didn't get Lady Apples, Lady Alice Apples, so I'm just going through to see what I bought, let's see, I got milk, so I need to do that, so you click on it, and this is a dollar on any brand of milk, so you just click that, and usually... You just click it. Sometimes it's a question. So you can just go through. I didn't get eggs. I got yogurt. I don't know if this will qualify, but we'll do it anyway. And sometimes there's a little question that you can click, but you just go and unlock each item. I got cheese on any shredded. I didn't get shredded cheese. Let's see. Someone I know. <clears throat> excuse me. Is that Quaker? No. Um... Melody bars, sorry, I'm trying to read these, so what I know, on my real Facebook page, they're up to $38 on here, and you can link it to, like, your PayPal account. Let's see here. I have bacon, I wonder if turkey bacon counts. So I was trying to find one with a question. And it just adds it in there. Alright, so I just go back. I didn't get any bread. I got, nope, no orange juice. Alright, let's see here. Cereal is at Sam's. Scan bra product barcode. Alright, so we've got, let's see, this cereal. That was for. Sam, so I have to go get that. So yogurt, I'm gonna click on that, and let me see here. Here it is. So we just scan the barcode. Just gonna line that up. There we go. Verified. <clears throat> and then I need to do the milk. Where's my milk? Over here. So I'm just gonna click milk and line that up. And then I got pasta. Sorry guys, my nose is running. And Hannah's playing with food in a container. All right, so click pasta. And line up my barcode. And then bacon. Hopefully we'll do turkey bacon. Yes, here we go. Let's see here. Huh, that was quick. All right, so that was everything for Kroger, I believe. And so I already scanned the receipt. Oh, well, I already, I gotta redo it. So uh, what we'll do, so here's my Kroger receipt. And you just lay it down. If you have something to hold it down, like I'm using my food, and you're just going to scan it. Oops. And let's see here. It's kind of hard to do. And it has to be like lined up perfectly with it. All right. So now I need to add a section. All right. And it left off at the cucumbers. So then you have to just find where, here's my cucumbers. So I'm just going to put my pasta right there. All right. And line it up. I need to move my bananas. Okay, so that's done. You click finish. I'm finished. So it's sending the receipt. And then it will let you know within 24 hours. 
if everything was verified. So I'm just gonna find my Sam's one. So if you use any apps or any websites that give you money or cash back or great access to coupon or whatnot, let me know below and let's have a little conversation in the description box or in the comment box with everybody else and let everybody else know what you use because I know a lot of couponers have great websites they use. My sister, she uses tons of websites. Those things take a lot of time to do if you're doing like the websites and like matching prices. Um, but you also like with the apps, you, most people have their phone with them all day anyway. So it's something that you can do really quickly right before you go to the store where you get ready to walk into the store or while you're meal planning and then when you get home have everything laid out and then do the um i bought app but uh thanks for joining me today and i will see you guys tomorrow bye guys